hello everybody fiasco here from Epcot's World Showcase for a Disney Dining Quick Take. As you can see, it's rainy here today and you could, you could say my parade has been rained on because I had high hopes to record some entertainment and such today, but entertainment's not happening with the rain. So bummer, but I always like to say, and I'm sure many people like to say, a rainy day at Epcot is better than a sunny day in a lot of other places. So we're gonna make the best of it. And I'm gonna do so as I did my little lap around the World Showcase, got the whiff of that smell and the, uh, the caramel store here behind me. Caramel Kush. Sorry if I said that wrong. You know what I'm talking about. As you walk through Germany, that store right at the front, that just want, it is so inviting. It's just like whew, that big whiff of caramel popcorn just draws you in. I'm gonna go in and get a cookie today. And before I do that, let me remind you, all these videos are brought to you by our sponsor, Dreams Unlimited Travel. Let our travel experts help you plan your next vacation. All that information and more can be found in the description below. All right, have my cookie here and I've already eaten lunch. So if this is good, you know it's good because I'm not even hungry. This thing was screaming my name. Let's see if it was worth four, it was uh, $4.59, $4.59, but after my annual pass discount, it was $3.90. That is a pretty good cookie. That combination of the, the salty pretzel and the chocolate chip and the cookie is just so satisfying. I feel like this would be probably twice as good if I warmed it up for a couple seconds in the oven or, or microwave, whatever your, your preference is, but it tastes just about as delicious as the store smells. And that store smells really good. I don't want to tote this up too high because last time I oversold a cookie, Disney changed it and it wasn't as good. Specifically talking about the France Pavilion cookie. The only thing I'd say is that the caramel makes it a little, the caramel that's drizzled on top makes it a little bit too sweet. I don't think it needs the caramel at all. In fact, I would suggest that the caramel is kind of just there for presentation to kind of give that, it that ooh ah factor of being in like a caramel, a caramel shop, you know? With that being said though, am I happy with my, uh, my $3.90 purchase? Yes, I am. So what does that make it? If it was four, four fifty nine without a discount, and I got so what did I get? Seventy cents off. It's so like ten percent discount. Well, I really enjoyed it, but like I mentioned, it is very, very sweet. Um, the first couple bites, I got a lot of that saltiness from the pretzel, but actually, as I worked my way to the end of the cookie it started to lose some pretzel. Like there was way less pretzel near the end. Um, I don't know, I guess it was just inconsistency with how many pretzels got into the bake. Um, but then that second half of the cookie was just super, super sweet. And I was kind of hoping that the caramel wouldn't be there, but it was there. Not complaining too much, but just keep that in mind. If like you're a person that, that there is something, there is such thing as too sweet, this might be a little bit too sweet, but I liked it. And that's gonna do it for this little, Disney dining quick take. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if the if the caramel store here in Germany has ever wafted you in and made you get something because it smells so dang good. And I must admit, while I do like the popcorn in there, the popcorn is not as good as the smell. This cookie, however, I though, though I, I I thought was was quite good. But I digress. That's gonna do it, and I'll see y'all in the next one. I uh, usually check beforehand, but in this case, I actually checked after. And I checked after on our channel, and it looks like Craig actually got the same cookie as me six months ago or seven months ago. So, you wanna hear what Craig thought? That link will be in the description below. And now, that's all I got for you, and I'll see you next time. Bye.